Technically, with EVS, we would be able to legally make the approach and start the approach. But obviously, if they got visual, they would land. We're on a small island in the Gulf Stream and in the English Channel. What regularly happens is the, the weather conditions are such that we have fog coming with very little notice, and that can be very disruptive to our flying. It's a new concept, new in the industry, it's new for regulation. Instead of uh, having to see the runway with the natural vision, you can use an EVS so that you can see the runway and the pilot will be allowed to land with such a picture. For us to be the first operator of uh, the ATR with EVS, uh, clearly it's an exciting opportunity. I've got no doubt that EVS is going to grow through the years. It's changing the way ATR can operate their aircraft. And I think it will really help us deliver something different for the local community.